That propeller is the draggiest thing on this thing. <laughs> awesome. And that's why you don't hit the ground with your prop spinning. Well, I guess I'm done. So I got a trial version of the CAD program Rhino, and I've been trying to figure it out on my own in the time that I probably should be sleeping. I tried making this little nozzle for the centrifugal plane, which actually made the power to thrust even worse. I also crashed it, and the removable nose like absorbed all of the force and unfolded itself. I've also been playing around with 3D modeling and printing a better centrifugal compressor. And then last week I played around with modeling a complex and precise fuselage pod to try out a few of my ideas. I printed it out yesterday at a low quality setting so that it wouldn't take us long, but it turned out pretty dang cool, and the whole thing weighs under 100 grams. One cool thing about this 3D modeling stuff is that I can just put this shape right into the wind tunnel and see the flow patterns and stuff. It is designed to mount the motor in the middle of the fuselage pod and replace the original motor shaft with a 200mm long one from eBay, which at the end is supported by a bearing. My idea is that this allows us to have the prop at the end of a long and skinny tail part, which the motor would not normally be able to fit into, and it also brings the weight of the motor farther forward. The nose of the pod is designed to house this FPV camera, and the axis hatch just snaps in place with magnets. I cut these wings out with some foam and some MH60 airfoil templates that I just had laying around in my room, and then I covered the wings with packaging tape with no spar. After the long stormy day today, the weather cleared just in time for me to try it out. And it's awesome! I can't wait to fly FPV in the mountains. I've learned a lot in this experiment, and I can think of tons of things that I can do better next time. Inverted. Oh, I don't like inverted very much. Shoot, it's pretty fast. You know, for the breeziness, it's actually really stable. It's really not getting kicked around very much. Yep, unlimited vertical. Oh yeah! I do really want actually some rudders on this thing, that'd be awesome. Some yaw control. This is like that much throttle, so like maybe 45%. See that roll? <laughs> Whoo! It just goes places. That propeller is the draggiest thing on this thing.